Eamon Khan here, four seconds out with the victorious Astrid Duet. Astrid, must feel great to get the victory. Absolutely. I knew I would do it. I've been training really hard and sparring some really cool people this time around. So, And to get a knockdown as well, I was really happy with that. Um, but yeah, it feels really good. Thanks. What were you seeing to force those moments of success to get that knockdown? Um, just stay composed. And, you know, I think she was... I'm trying to think. She was waiting for me to throw the first shot so she could kind of come back with something, um, which I think I should have worked that out a little bit sooner and maybe step back and let her come at me. Um, but yeah, I feel like I was just a little bit more powerful than her. You know, she landed a few shots, but none of them really hurt. Uh, whereas I think when I was catching her, especially with the backhand, it was chucking her head back and she wasn't enjoying it. So yeah, I just think power, basically. It might be the impact of the action, but I'm looking in your eyes and I can see like someone who might have been crying. Were you crying after the victory? No, oh, okay. I might have had some like tears of joy, yeah. like I was really happy because especially when they uh, called out the um, the scores, mm. the first one was a draw, so I was like, so then when they called out the win, obviously I was really happy, but yeah. We were rewind last night to the weigh-in, I believe she handed out cards with you with the bruised face and like you in an ambulance. Uh, what was your reaction to that and did it make you want to hurt her more? I didn't actually know that she did that. The only thing I, I found one and I just thought it was just the one as a little gift for Some me. Some random person just bought it? It was, all, it was just on the floor. Mm. So I was like, oh, what's that? Um, but it made me laugh because the one with me with bruises is when I won my last fight. I didn't lose that fight so it didn't really offend me. Um, and the one in the ambulance I just thought was pretty funny to be honest. You know, Looking back at it, it's a fun photo so it didn't affect me in any way I thought you know she's she's gonna try and do whatever she can to get to me that past week but nothing really did I just had a quick look at your shoes while you're doing the interview and you're wearing fly boots so you gotta be proficient to put those boots to use do you feel that like you've improved in your technique from when you started to now a hundred percent yeah a hundred percent um yeah from when I first started over a year ago I was literally two left feet basically uh, so to be where I am now I'm really proud of myself and yeah Alexi should be proud of herself too she's done a good job when you first started, there was talk of you and Elbrook. You are both kind of now in different places. It feels like that fight's more distant than it's ever been. Do you think you two will ever meet in the ring? No idea, but whatever she does, I wish her all the best. Did you see her and AJ get into it? No, I heard about it, but I didn't see it. So I'm not really sure what happened there, but I don't understand that because I don't think AJ really wants to fight her. Um, so yeah, we'll see. Finally, Katie Price, um, she's never fought before. I think she might have the size and reach advantage on you, but <laughs> yeah. you want to take on that challenge? I just think it'll be a really entertaining fight. You know, why not? Mm -hmm. Congratulations, Ashley. Well Thank done. you so much. Cheers.